This is the Introduction to Ecology, but this is supplemental information for population distribution and abundance in Chapter 9. Uh, we're actually looking at the Endangered Species Essay uh, and the, what sort of things are required for it. There's a nice picture of a kangaroo family. So, first of all, the question that we're asking for this Endangered Species Essay Regarding any threatened and endangered species, TNE species, anywhere, or any species native or endemic to Florida, what are the primary threats to their existence? Write an essay that explores those primary threats. Sounds easy enough. Well, it goes on. So, re repeating that question, threatened and endangered species, anywhere, any species native to Florida, among those threats may be one of the following. Global climate change. Invasive exotic species, habitat destruction, and or competition from other native organisms, to name a few things. Now, if appropriate, consider other legitimate threats not listed above. I don't know why that went away. Come back. There we go. In this essay, well, that went away either. I need to fix that. In this essay, consider what is being done to protect the species, and if nothing is being done, what can be done to protect the species? Grading likes to know what the grading is going to be. The assignment is worth 200 points. The total assignment, when you get the both draft and the final done, 25% of your total grade. The grading rubric will provide details regarding the value of these parts. Posted in the news portion of the class D2L page, as well as in the content section, the essay should be between 500 and 700 words. This is different from what is listed in the previous lecture which was dated, recorded that a few years ago. Use at least five citable references, six if you use the te textbook, and grading. Wikipedia is not a valid reference for this assignment. All references should be in MLA style. Drafts will be checked for plagiarism through turnitin.com. Uh, link to online resources for both MLA citation methods and plagiarism is going to be available. Uh, now, you don't submit this to turnitin.com. That is automatic with this particular Dropbox. Submit it to the Dropbox. If at all possible, please use Microsoft Word for your submitted work. We'll accept uh, Word documents, text documents, RPF, no, RTF files, uh, PDF files, those sorts of things. There's a list of those also uh, in the grading rubric. Important dates. Draft the essay is due to the Dropbox in D2L Friday, November 4th, 7 p.m. This is 2016. This draft is worth 100 points, which is the same for this course as half the total endangered species essay assignment grade, 12.5% of your total grade. Not turning it in will cost you a letter grade. Okay, so how do you get that? Late drafts decline in value by 25% per day, 75 points, you can read through that, etc. Zero after November 7th. Just turning in the draft is worth 100 points. That's all you have to do is turn in a draft, something I can grade. By that deadline, you get 100 points. It's worth it. Do it. All right. Last important dates. Drafts will be graded and a copy returned to you electronically, no paper involved, um, at least by the Monday before Thanksgiving. I have every intention of getting it done long before that, but uh, you never know. Anyway, at least by November 21st, and you will have until Friday, December 2nd, all of Thanksgiving break, uh, to make those corrections that I su suggest and submit the final essay to the final endangered species drop box in D2L. Questions? Send me an email or give me a call. Anyway, thanks. I look forward to reading those things.